Hey guys, Radio MMA back here with another video prediction. This time we're talking Andre the Pitbull Arlovsky taking on Josh Barnett going down this Saturday night in Germany. And let's get right to it, to veterans of the sport. Um, this should be a good one. Okay, we'll head on over and check out Andre Arlovsky to start out this uh, video. Andre. 37, uh, nicknamed the Pitbull. He's a Belarusian, 6 foot 3, 248 pounds, a heavyweight, 77 inch reach. His style of sambo, kickboxing, boxing, stance orthodox. He's fighting out of Chicago, Illinois, currently with Jackson's Winkle John's team in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Okay, he has a career record of 25 wins, 12 losses, 1 no contest. And we scroll down and look at his record a little bit. He's coming off back-to-back -back TKO losses, 1 to Stipe and the other one to Overeem. Um, the 1 to Stipe was a uh, K TKO loss 54 seconds into the very first round. And then he lost to Overeem 1 minute 12 seconds in the second round. Um, before that, he had quite a role. He ran off six straight wins, um, getting some impressive victories over uh, Brennan Schwab, Antonio Bigfoot Silva, Travis Brown, and Frank Mir. Um, now, back in 2009 to 2011, he went through this four-fight losing streak, and a lot of people said his chin was done, he was done, but he bounced back. And uh, that's kind of what he's looking to do here. You know, he needs to bounce back. He's had uh, two straight TKO losses. And uh, the fight with Travis Brown, he got rocked hardcore. Was able to bounce back, though, and get that uh, TKO victory. Head on over to Josh Barnett. Josh Barnett. Scroll to the top of the page. Josh, 38 years old. Um, the War Master, six foot three, two hundred and forty-one pounds, seventy-eight inch reach. His style is catch wrestling. Um, he has a career record of thirty-four and eight. Um, scroll down to his recent past. He's had two fight, or sorry, four fights in the UFC since his return. He got the win over Frank Mir. Uh, lost to Travis Brown KO in the first round. Um. Defeated Roy Nelson in Japan, and then in Newark, New Jersey, he lost to Ben Rothwell. Submission, go-go choke um, in the second round. And that was a real shocker um, to see Ben Rothwell out-grapple um, Josh Barnett. Okay, and we'll just head on over here to the MMA betting odds. And as you can see here, Five Dimes has it. Um... On June the 4th, the odds were minus 210. Since that money's been coming in on Andre Arlovsky, it got up to as high as minus 150, brought back down now to minus 160. But you can see from this graph that uh, the fans and the betters are laying money down on the pit bull, Andre Arlovsky. Interesting enough, Arlovsky is the sixth ranked heavyweight in the world. Barnett is number nine. Um, but styles make fights, right? That's the old saying. So, uh, you can't put too much into the ranking system here. Um, a few months ago, Arlovsky, you know, he was on the verge of getting a, uh, championship title shot. Okay, so, <clears throat> thinking about this fight a little bit, for me anyways, um, I don't believe Josh Barnett has... The huge knockout power that's going to give Arlovsky trouble. If you uh, look at the Andre Arlovsky uh, TKOs here, Overeem, huge power. Uh, Stipe has huge power. Travis Brown, even though Arlovsky won that fight, he's got huge power. Um, so all his losses have come to guys that have huge power. I think Arlovsky has two major skill sets. Number one... He likes to throw. He's got good hands. Number two, he's good at takedown defense. Um, so the old sprawl and brawl 
uh, for Andre Olavsky. Uh, for Josh Barnett, he needs to outgrapple him. Um, for him to get victories here, he needs to win the fight in the clinch, and he needs to win the fight on the ground, and he needs to get a submission. Now, as this fight goes longer, obviously that will favor Josh Barnett. Um, I don't even remember the last time uh, Andre Arlovsky went five rounds, if he ever did. Um, but um, obviously uh, in Japan, Josh Barnett went five rounds with Roy Nelson. So I think as the fight goes on, it favors Josh Barnett. But my prediction here is going to be Andre Arlovsky TKO in the third round. Um, yeah, I, actually, I think I'm going to change that. I think I'm going to go second round Andre Arlovsky here because as the fight goes longer, certainly he's going to favor Josh Barnett. Um, so that's my pick. Andre Arlovsky plus money. He is the underdog here. Um, He's paying out right now at plus 130, so lay down 100 bucks, you'll get paid 230. Okay guys, thanks for checking out another video. Please hit me up on Twitter, it's Radio MMA. Please like, subscribe my video, and uh, comment below. Thanks guys.